Hello everyone. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to create Office Click to Run 2016 in SCCM. First of all, you need to download the contents. I'm going to go to Google. I'm going to type in Office Click to Run ODT. I'm going to click this one here, Download Office Deployment Tool. Click on Download. So I downloaded it a few minutes ago and I'm going to download it again. I just download it again, so I'm just going to run the exe there. I'm going to click OK here. I'm going to put it under C drive. Make a new folder called ODT. Highlight, click OK. File extracted successfully. I'm going to my C drive. You should be able to find it. ODT. I'm going to edit this. So by default, it gives you um, Office Pro Plus and the Visio for retail. I'm going to customize it by move, remove the Visio. And also I'm going to disable the auto updates. I want to control the updates from SCCM. So I'm going to remove that. Change this to a false. I'm going to click Save As. I'm just going to call this Office 365 XML. Here's the file. Now I'm going to go to the command prompt to download the contents. I'm going to change the directory to ODT. To download the contents, you need to type in setup.exe slash download. And the name of the config file, which is office365.xml. As you can see here, it's created a folder and it's downloading the contents. It's going to take a few minutes to finish. For now, I'm just going to pause the video and then come back once it's completed. All right, it looks like the, um, the download has been completed. So now I'm going to copy the contents to my SCCM server. Uh, let's check out the size of this. So it's downloading the Office Pro Plus only. There's no Visio, there's no project. So I'm going to copy that and put it on my SCCM server. Repositories. Share. Put under packages. I'm going to create a new folder called Office. Click to run 2016. 
I'm going to paste it here. So it's copying. While it's doing that, I'm going to go to SSCM console to create the package. I'm going to launch my console. While it's loading, I'm going to get a drink a cup of coffee here. All right, so I'm going to the software library under applications, go under packages, create a new package. Call it Microsoft Office. Click to run 2016. The description you can put in the description manufacturer is not required, language is not required, version is not required. I'm just going to put Microsoft version is 2016. We we'll put in the path of what the um, the contents is. Click next, and then I'm, I'm going to need to create a standard programs. I'm going to call this install office click to run 2016. The command line should be set up dot exe slash config file configured and then the name of the config file which is office 365 xml xml i'm gonna run as whether or not user is log on normal and then run with administrate rights click next if you want to limit it to windows 10 you can just click here and then choose windows 10 but i'm not going to do that I'm just going to click the top one click next it's creating Make sure it's all green. All right, now it looks like the package has been created. Now I'm going to have to distribute the contents to, to the DP. Click on right click and then click on distribute contents. Let's just go back. I forgot to explain. So you right click, you go to distribute content, click next. I'm going to choose the DP, click OK, next, next, and make sure it's green. And you can check if the content has been distributed successfully just by going to the package. Looks like it's fail. see here I'm not sure why it's failing Oh, I think I need to give SCCM full access to the the share.
I'm going to change it to find people. Location. I'm going to add in my service account. Right, let's go back here. Let's look at the package contents again. data source that is correct so that's basically how you create how you download office click to run and then create a package in SCCM I gotta figure out what's wrong with my DP, so I will do that later. So for now, this is how you create it. Thank you for watching my video and let me know what other topics you want me to cover. Just make comments on this video and uh, I do my best to create the video for you guys. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and thank you for watching.